Diana, she always All right, guys. About him. Jay plays him at Absolution, episode three. What's the next level got for us? Some fun excitement. Waiting. For what? You still have a chance. Switching in one of the teams, but this is a job for 47. Why did you do this? Do not turn my turn to you. Take the go and run. Seven's a cutter. Yes. Terminus Hotel, room eight nine nine. Forgot to. Uh, <clears throat> I forgot to turn on subtitles. I'm gonna do it right now, actually. Ooh, I think this is a long Just level, guys. This video might take a while. And the answer came back in the shape of a name. Blake Dexter. Long, long level. An arms industry VIP who seems to have taken a special interest in your girl. Dexter occupies the Terminus's top floor, and his thug has had the place sealed off tight. Still, a man of your skills and resources should be able to find several access points. Good luck, Holmes. Right. Again, guys, I do know it's going to be in sound. Oh, that one thing I like to do is turn music down. Um, subtitles is in graphics. And there it is. Actually, I'm going to make it a bit brighter, maybe. There you go. Now we're talking. All right. Like I said, I've played the game a few times already, so I know basically one way to get through the game, and that's the way I'm going to get through it. by her. I'm going to swap the ball for a brick. Because it's all about picking up everything in the game, right? I'm going to clobber this guy with the brick, actually, I think. No, I'm not. I'm just going to make him unconscious. Alright. Let's see. He had... Mustang snub with whatever gun he has. A six shooter or my six shooter. I guess I like his six shooter better. Alright, we'll take his outfit and hide him. Only three outfits in this level for the challenge. It's all about challenges, right? All about challenges. Oh, that's no good. He saw me. This guy's is blown. Who saw me? Guards alerted. Off to a bad start. Guys, here's combat. Oh boy. Reloading. 
Messing around with electricity in a flooded pit? Not for a million bucks, no sir. Shit. All right, so now they're looking for me. This was not my ideal route, or it's not even a good route. <laughs> I had better routes. I just came from upstairs. Let me think. Let me think. I need those guys to leave so that I can get in that elevator. There you go. Alright. Alright, so far so not terrible. Could be better, could be worse. I think there was a custodian outfit that I missed down there. Nice work, 47. You sure are a resourceful son of a bitch. Ooh, you're approaching the lion's den now. Thugs you encountered are gonna have the eighth floor completely under lockdown. Now, Blake Dexter, he enjoys his privacy. And sneaking into 899 is not gonna be an easy task. And to make matters worse, this is protected by a seriously nasty bodyguard who will not, and I repeat, not take kindly to trespassers. She should probably look to get off at a lower floor and look for a more subtle entry point. But what am I saying? A pro like you, you probably got the whole thing figured out, don't you? Alright, go get him. All right, so where am I trying to go? Okay, so you're gonna do that. He's gonna come out and check on his speakers. Hello. Pooh Man is like spreading bad vibes out here. Hello, anyone? I usually actually go a completely different route, but this route works also. Um, window over here, I think. Yep. There you go. Okay. So. up here. Yeah, usually I sneak my way around uh, inside up, up uh, the inside and then do something else. This works too. Alright. Let's pull this guy out. If 
I look at this pamphlet, this guy won't see me. It's not true, he won't see me, he just won't. Because guards can see through disguises. So right now, he thinks, uh, he doesn't see through the disguise because um, I'm looking at the pamphlet. So once he turns around, and that guy turns around, I can sneak through the door right there. Alright, there you go. That's what you want. And... Oh, hopefully they don't see me. Hopefully they don't see me. And they didn't see me. That was close. And I've gotten into the room. So this door is locked. Direct approach is not an option. I need an alternate point of entry, which is this vent. Her name is Victoria, and she's worth a lot of fucking money. Nah, she's some kind of enhanced wonder child or something. Point is, we go in, we grab her, we hang on to her until they give us the ransom. She sounds like something you came up with in one of your labs. Oh, who the fuck asked for your opinion anyway? You're a fucking asshole, you know that? You know, your job is to shut up, do what I say, and look good. <laughs> and you do look good, honey. <laughs> Sweet talker. Well, I'm making my way that way. Oh, well, not that long at all. Point shooting. Tagmo consumes less instinctive over time. That's good. Reduces tagging cost of point shooting. I haven't really done point shooting yet, guys, but it's going to come up later. Pain suppression. Ah, recover faster. That's good. 4,000. Not, well, better score. What did I get? 16,000? Not great. Not great. Spotted could have been better. Non-target casualty could have been better. Classification was going to be what it was. So you can see, yeah, janitor and electrician, those are on the bottom floor, and I didn't get those. There's, If you want to collect everything in this level, you have to walk around a lot to pick up all these things. Um, electrician is electrocuting people, inside job, not quite sure. Well, that was it. Shorter than I thought it was, but I guess it's because I was combining missions in my head. Sorry about that. Well, if anything, it makes for easier viewing for you guys. So, that's going to bring an end to this episode of J Plays uh, Hitman Absolution. Tell it in the name of.